Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else. And the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cassie. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news to the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat plague. Time? Yes, yes. The pressure was too low. All these new machines. Hello, sir. Corvo, you're back. Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait! Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. While you were gone, Mother seemed very sad. I think she missed you. Let's see if you're still good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. We should go now, so Mother can see you too. Aww. Did you see any monsters while traveling to the other isles? My nanny says the big ocean's full of them. But I think she only says that to scare me. 
Later, will you give me more climbing lessons? Someday I'm going to climb up to the rooftop. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. Things are bad. She'll see you at once. <clears throat> it's been good traveling with you, Corvo. Mm -hmm. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens. And we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. What news have you Follow brought? Follow me, Captain. We should leave the... I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before. Knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! <laughs> Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Oh, 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 mommy! Oh. Get away! Corvo! Corvo... It's all coming apart. Find... Find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one who'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Take him. Chance, Corvo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. 
Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed. But it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now. Someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this. Even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time. And someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corpo. God! Take it back to his cell. You should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend. That guy who killed the Empress? Another night. Another patrol with you. How come so many people are coming to the execution tomorrow? You're out. Good for you. Cord. Cut some throat. The one who killed the Empress and abducted her daughter, Emily. So it's an occasion. Right. A social event for the high and mighty. Attention. A solitary group off limits to make the truth. Unless accompanied by an officer of the walk, escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Corvo's unconscious again. Though 
he's taken more punishment than the two men we brought in for interrogation. When he wakes, we'll start again. Having him sign the confession for her murder isn't critical. And a proof but dignitary it could be useful to us later. The assassination of an empress is not a trivial matter. Ackworth, you lazy slug. Did you patrol the yard? Sorry, not yet. I was gonna report that boiler leak from yesterday. Forget it. Just do your rounds. The report's trouble for both of us. I'm moving. Set up. Attention, the solitary wing is off limits to make Not everyone did? Unless really accompanied like by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Did he kill on his way out of the prison? I guess if he killed the Empress, he don't care about a few guards. Shut up! Look at this stuff. Somebody's been down here. Mom.
of that. That's too far. I don't want to catch the flat. Yes? No. Doesn't the elixir prevent it? Maybe. Either way, let's dump them down there. That's the last one. Attention, Dunwall citizens. The assassin Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. Several brave officers of the state are dead by his hand. He is to be captured or killed at any cost. Won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take him out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make... Hey, what was that? I'm Samuel, and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here, but I could still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them, just down the river from here.
Crown Pits pub. Closed for business, half the district marked off as dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the loyalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered, but before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times. But his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes. Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. The month of peace has increased. The Lord Regent has decreed that plague ordinances will remain in effect through the month of rain. Stay alert and stay loyal. Must be Corvo. I am Lydia, at your service. Your room is upstairs and ready. When they told me who it was, well, I thought you'd be older, like the Admiral. River traffic is forbidden from landing in the distillery district due to risk of infectious contact. Violators will be taken to the flooded district for treatment and rehabilitation. Pleased to meet you, Master Corvo. I saw you at court in happier days, but you might not remember. I was once a close ally to the Lord Regent, Hiram Burroughs, back when he was just the spy master. He's one manipulative bastard, I can tell you that. Furnishings have been installed at last with no small amount of complaining by that antiquated boatman. The others have no idea what it's like to suffer as I have. If I may, I am the personal assistant to Lord Pendleton and one of the senior servants at Pendleton House, as was my father. Now I am entrusted with this house, the home of the Loyalists. I have never seen the Admiral Do fail at any venture. If order can be restored to the city of Demolore, I believe he can do it. If anyone can get your old area. life back, it's him. The only way to help them is to bring them to the city watch. They will be taken to the flooded district for treatment.
I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. No! This cannot happen now. The tank of whale oil is running. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. Oil to unstable. When it explodes, there's a terrible mess. The Academy teaches that absurd idea that the energy in whale oil arises from the need to maintain life functions at extreme ocean depths. The pressure in the cold are too much to endure Perfect. without it. Now plug it I in. I speculate that a human being might. Perfect. Thank you, Cole. Here, see? The assassin's mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? Some lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. Life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Very well. You know best. Let me know if you need anything more. Yes, very much so, but no need to fear. He is here to work with our masters. People say he killed the Empress. Of course he didn't. People are foolish and believe whatever they're told. Okay. If the Admiral trusts him, then so will I. The Admiral served in the Navy under the Empress. But something happened with the Lord Regent that drove the Admiral out. If I understand it right. Please follow me to your quarters. Attention Dunwall citizens. Be advised the river crust infestation has spread downriver as far as the river mouth and flooded districts. Do not attempt to approach or destroy a river crust. Any items recovered from doing so are considered state property. This is your room. It was chosen to give you privacy. I understand you'll need your rest.
Hello, Corvo. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you, and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that we call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Come find me. that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest.
Attention Dunwall citizens. River traffic is forbidden from landing in the distillery district due to risk of it. Thank <laughs> you.